Yo, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? I'm back again with another video. Got this another one, not talked about much product that um, I picked it up at Walmart a while back. I found that it's pretty good. It's not overpowering, but it's just right enough for um, interior detailing. And as you can see, this carpet down here. Now, this stuff, when you're using products like this right here, guys, you got to be careful how much you spray. Like I tell you guys, because it's cold now, it's damp. Um, I know you could use a wet and dry bag and all that kind of stuff, but you really don't, still don't want to put down too much or wet the carpets too much, whether it be damp, light, because it's cold and it's going to take longer to dry up. So me personally, like I tell you guys, I don't really, I'm not a big fan of scrubbing on other people's cars, you know. Uh, I like to clean my own cars, you know. <laughs> I got a yard full, man. You know what I'm saying? I love to clean up on my own stuff. So, you know, I don't... I clean people's cars. I got a couple customers that I clean cars for. But uh, I'm not a big fan of it. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I enjoy better detail in my own cars. That's what really moves me, you know. So, when you're using products like this, you're going to want to be careful how much you spray. You don't want to wet the area too much. And um, if you're doing it for a customer or you're out there doing mobile detailing, and these are great products to, to look into. They're pretty good strength. You can buy this by the gallon, I think, for like $12. I think it's dilutable. And uh, it said easy refill baller. Now, this little baller cost me like $4 and some change, if I'm not mistaken. And it says it's powerful, safer, and easier to use. Okay, it's an WD-40 specialist. It's an industrial screen cleaner and degreaser. And it's for multiple surface, low odor, and biodegradable. So it's safe to use. All right, so you can use this just about clean anything, you know. No big deal. And it's telling you right here on the bag, it said, don't, don't, I promise, cleaning power for safety. All right, it says right here, powerful industrial screen contains biosolvent technology. Safer, non-flammable, biodegradable, multi-surface cleaner. Easier, ready to use, no mess, no diluting, easy refill. Okay, so you don't really have to dilute this. It's already ready to go. Now, even the gallon size, if you get it out of Walmart, it's already ready to go. Now, stuff like this, it might not be so cost-effective, but you know what I'm saying? It's cool if you're doing your own vehicles. All right, so see the stain right here? We're going to spray something on this stain, see what it do. Now, this whole area is stained. You can see the brownness here. Okay. Oh, dude, switch hands for a minute. There we go. Almost taking the stain away just by spraying it. Now you don't want to spray too much of products like this, like I said, because it's um, it's gonna um, wet the carpet too much. So I'm gonna show you guys what I do a lot of time when I do interior cleaning. Now most of the custom cars that I clean, the interior doesn't be dirty, like you know not really dirty 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 you know so i don't really I had to scrub their carpets and i just vacuum theirs out in most cases all right so now what i do i just done penetrated in on the stain now what I, i'm gonna show you guys how much bite a microfiber cloth can have on this watch this guys see that okay A lot of people don't know, some do, but just using a plain microfiber cloth, I really give it enough bite. See here, to pull the dirt. You see the stain? Just biting it with that microfiber cloth actually is enough bite to get the dirt out of the carpet. 
You don't actually need a brush always, you know. And I can simply hit this again. And uh, yeah, like I said, guys, you don't necessarily need a brush always. Concentrating in that area. All right, now what I can do. And... Okay, that's good right there. Now I'm concentrating in this area that I sprayed. I'm going to let it sit there for a second. Now, if you're interested in this product, it's at Walmart. It's over there where it's Simply Green and the Zip Cleaner and all that stuff. It Not in the car section. It's over there in the cleaning area where you get, uh, like, crew cutters and stuff like that. You guys will know what I'm talking about when you go to Walmart. That's where, you, that's where you'll find this product. Okay. Now, just be surprised, like I said, how much bite a microfiber cloth can give you. You don't really have to have a brush to do this. You can use a microfiber cloth and some elbow grease and get the job done. So a lot of people think, you know, they're doing interior de detailing. Oh, man, you got to have that, that cleaning brush, uh, that kind of brush. You got to have that uh, carpet brush. You got to have uh, a leather brush and all that stuff. No, you don't. You gonna have a good cleaner and a microfiber cloth. The microfiber cloth actually got enough bite to it to do a clean a lot of stuff. And a lot of people don't know that. Take this rag like this, kind of poke your hands in it, fold it a certain way. Come in here, scrub it just like this. Got to get a good grip on that microfiber cloth though. Want to get a good grip on the microfiber cloth as you come in here. See here, it's pulling the dirt stains up off the carpet, and it looks pretty decent, as you can see. And you can see where the it just pulled the dirt right off the carpet there. See that? Now, using just a microfiber cloth, like I said, guys, have plenty of bite for scrubbing carpets. And at the same time, it's drying the carpet. As you put the product down, it's drying it back up. Okay, now, so what I can do, I can just take it, widespread, just hit it, hit this area here, because it's not badly dirty. And this is when you're doing interior detailing. You gotta hit the whole area. So I ain't clean side to the microfiber cloth. Just come in here like this. Doesn't take a lot of time. See, you don't need no wet and dry vacs all the way, all always now when you're shampooing carpets, cleaning carpets and stuff. And this is an 89 model Honda Accord now. Don't forget that. See that? That carpet looks really good for an 89 auto. Now, this at the same time, it's giving a, a clean smell. Uh, you're not wetting the carpets too much. And when you're using a microfiber cloth like this, it's picking the water from the product right back up into the cloth. At the same time, it's cleaning it. You're just using the product for the strength of the cleaning abilities that's in it. So you don't want to wet the carpets too much. Like I said, because it's cold here. <laughs> so when you get your customer car back, you know, you don't want to get them back with the carpets all wet all up. You know, you want to make sure it's dry before you get back to your customer. So that's that's one thing that um you want to make sure. And this stuff is very effective, strong. It has a lot of power to it, but it's not overpowered, you know. And like I said, I haven't heard too many people really work with this product but myself, you know, before. Other than that, I just ain't heard too many people working with it. But, um, you gotta do interior detailing out here, man. That's part of, um, cleaning cars, you know. People be talking about the outside of the car, but they never talk about interior detailing. Some of the stuff that you gotta do when you Talking uh cleaning the interior, you know. Gotta do it all. 
That's where it's got to be done. But you guys see, I'm still pulling some dirt. See? You just keep scrubbing it. Scrub it a couple times. The car is old. You don't get it perfect, perfect, perfect. But you'll get it clean, you know. Cause it's going to look clean to the eye anyway. Because it already looks clean now. See? And it's dry. It's basically almost dry. So that's another good thing. So I scrub and I do the same thing. I'll show you guys how I do to my seats in another video for my cloth seats. And I um, got to clean them too, as well as the carpet. All right, and it's also get a whole car, like a nice, fresh smell. It smells good on the interior now. Okay, so guys, let's demonstrate a little bit. When you really, you, you don't have to always have a brush when you're doing interior detailing. You can use just a microfiber cloth and um, just scrub them carpets with a microfiber cloth. I don't know how many people you've seen do that, but it works. You can spray your cleaner down and just put your little elbow grease on it. Y'all saw how I do it. You can scrub with a microfiber cloth. Don't really always need a brush. And it works because the microfiber cloth has a bite to it itself. See, it'll bite down enough in them carpets to pull the dirt. All right. So, guys, I hope you enjoy, man. Just having a little fun. Like I said, I like to detail my own cars. You know, I ain't too crazy about cleaning up for car. You know, I told you guys that I'd rather clean up on my own cars. Alright, so uh, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with, with your family and your friends. And uh, till next time, man, y'all clean them interiors up, man. I enjoy doing it. Y'all take care, and I'll hit y'all on the next video. I'm out of here. I enjoy doing my own calls now, not everybody. I'm out. Peace. <laughs>